did want to remind you, of course, we talk about uh, the warming oceans and more the warmer the ocean, the more energy that includes winter storms. But I think for a lot of us, we can really relate to the fact, OK, warmer water means more energy, means more intense uh, and possibly more typhoons and hurricanes. Uh, but it is still our winter slash spring, right? Well, not so in the southern hemisphere. Remember, just like our September tends to be the month with the most hurricanes and the most intense hurricanes, the southern hemisphere's March is really our September. And sure enough, in March, down over the southern hemisphere, it is active. Going to go all the way to the Indian Ocean, in case you haven't heard about it. Freddie has been out there and has already broken a record. Now, this is Freddie. This is Madagascar. This is Mozambique. And Freddie is probably going to re-intensify as Freddie heads away from Madagascar toward Mozambique and becomes once again equivalent to what we would call a Category 1 or 2 hurricane. So again, it's already broken the record for the longest lasting in the Indian Ocean. It's at 30 days. It's probably going to pass the record of John, which was a record for the Eastern Pacific, and it may go to 35 days. Just an incredible record. Close